I got, I got, I got, I got loyalty, got royalty inside my DNA. Cocaine quarter piece, got war and peace inside my DNA. I got power, poison, pain, and joy inside my DNA. What is up, guys? Welcome back to the German Muscle channel. So, if any of you guys have watched my previous videos, then you guys will know that I absolutely love everything that McGuire's makes. So, I've been using their ultimate compound and ultimate polish for years. And the core that I have now has a lot of scratches all over it. So that's what I'm going to try to fix in this video. So I went to the store and picked up Meguiar's Scratch X 2.0 Fine Scratch and Blemish Remover. So um, I'm not able to use my uh, big buffer. So I'm just going to use a little handheld one that I've been using in videos. But if you go on the back, it says you can use by hand. So dispense a small amount of product onto a 100% cotton terry towel or foam applicator pad. Work Scratch X 2.0 thoroughly into the surface one section at a time. So if you guys want to pause that and read it, you can. So um, let's go ahead and get to work. So I have two scratches right here and uh, I know this paint is like really shiny I haven't even buffed it or anything but right here is two scratches and uh, you can kind of hear that on this one it definitely sounds like my nail is catching into it yeah that's definitely a deep scratch so isn't this one but up here towards where they end at you guys can see that like right up here it's not really all that deep so there is a couple more scratches right here and um, those don't actually catch on the nail so I'm going to apply a little bit of scratch X 2.0 to this whole area right here and uh, see if we can get these scratches out. So before I do that, I got some Mother's Instant Detailer and I'm just gonna spray this area down right here. Got a clean microfiber towel. Let's go and clean the area up real quick. Just like that. So I don't have my tripod that I normally use, so this video might be a little shaky. Let's go ahead and get started on these scratches. All right, so I got this uh, auto spa that I always use. It's gonna lay right there. By the way, you can tell there's a lot of scratches all over this car. So got the Scratch X 2.0. Put a little dab right there, and. Uh, come down here actually I'm gonna tape this off okay guys so got it taped off where the scratches are they're right there and can't really see the other ones but yeah right there you can see them now so just rub it in turn on the little button So now I'm just going to go ahead and wipe this off with a clean microfiber towel. Just want to lightly buff it. And as you guys can tell, the scratches are still there, but they're really faint. So the other scratches are actually almost gone, but you can still see them. But you can go over it a couple more times, and the more that you do it, the more the scratch will disappear. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply a second coat of the Scratch X to this area. And you wanna put firm pressure on it, that way the product will actually go inside of the scratch and fill it in. So I wanna go ahead, put another little skim coat on here and uh, we'll see how it turns out. All right guys, so I got a little bit more on the little polisher. So it's gonna work it into the scratches. All right, guys, so now I'm just going to go ahead and wipe this off. Oh, 
Okay, so as you guys can tell, the scratches are still there. And the other ones are there a little bit, but they're actually not as bad. So this stuff will actually take out scratches. I've used it before, that's why when I open up the lid, you guys seen all the uh, product all over the inside of it. That's because I've already used it. And uh, it actually works pretty good. So because these scratches right here, you can actually feel on your fingernail as you rub it across. These will actually have to be sanded down and then buffed out so that way the scratch will be gone. But let's go ahead and try it right here where all these scratches are. This is from when I sanded down the fender and buffed it out after I painted it. So if you guys remember the video that I did on this, there was a dent right there that I fixed with Bondo. And the whole front side of the fender was just completely tore up with rock chips and all that stuff. So... Um, I sanded down the fender, repainted the front half of it, and uh, shortly after, I got more rock chips. So, um, let's go ahead and see if we can remove all these scratches right here. There's a lot of scratches, so I'm going to go ahead and take the tape off right here, clean this area up, and then see if we can remove those scratches. Alright guys, so as you can tell... This is where all the scratches are. I just cleaned it with the instant detailer, wiped everything down. It is dry, so not gonna have any water mixing with this stuff. So um, I know this pad is really messed up. I've had it for like five years. Uh, so let's go ahead and give it a shot. So as you guys can tell, that is a bunch of sand scratches from where um, I wet sanded it and uh, actually buffed this out a couple of times and scratches just didn't get filled in. So we're going to see if Scratch X 2.0 can take these scratches out. Um, if the camera angle is really crappy, that's because I'm holding the camera. I don't have my tripod with me. It's actually in my other car. So just bear with me guys. Don't leave a dislike because crappy camera angles. So just rub it into the paint. I'm gonna take our microfiber towel and just wipe all this off. Okay, so right off the bat, I can already tell that it took some of the scratches out. So they are no longer that visible uh, you can still see some right here and over there and I still need to wipe all that off but as you guys can tell um, can't really tell because my hand is yeah but let's see if we can do it like that okay so all these scratches that were up here there you go you can see them a little bit right there but all the ones that were up here by the turn signal they're actually gone so and that was a big spot right there so it actually took down the sand scratches a lot you can still see them a little bit it's just because this is the first pass so um i guarantee a couple more passes and the scratches will be completely gone so this is just by hand um, just a little auto spall that I have and wiping it off with a terry cloth So if I can get scratches to come out by hand imagine what um, a big professional Polisher thing like that can do So anyways um, It says that It removes fine scratches and blemishes so There you go guys um like I said, you can still see the scratches. That's just because th that was the first pass. And uh, you can actually see, I don't know if it'll pick it up on camera or not, but this side right here where I put the scratch X is actually a lot darker than this side right here. So yeah, you guys can see it. This side is a lot darker than this side. So this side actually looks really faded 
compared to this side. Just to let you guys know, when I sprayed the instant detailer, when I cleaned the fender, I sprayed all the way from over here to over here. And you can tell that this is really dull and this is really shiny. So I'm gonna go show you guys the other spots that I did the other day when I first got the product and uh, I'll show you guys what I did to the paint. All right guys, so I don't know how well you guys will be able to see it on camera, but I did a small circle right here. I can see it in person. It's a lot darker directly right here in the center and around it is faded, but um, I don't know if you guys can see that or not, but in this whole circle right here is where I put the uh, scratch X at. And it actually took a lot of scratches out. So right here is where I put the scratch X. Right here is where I didn't. So you can tell a little bit that it took some of the scratches out. That was just one pass like I did on a fender. But like I said, I guarantee if you go over it a couple more times, it'll take out a lot more scratches. And if you use a professional polisher, like the one that I have in a the box, then I guarantee you'll probably take all the scratches out. So anyways, Meguiar's, if you're watching this, sponsor me, dude. I love you guys' products. Anyways, that is all I have for this video. So if you guys did like this video, be sure to leave a thumbs up. And if you guys have any tips and tricks on how to get scratches like that out, let me know down in the comment section below. And don't forget to smash that subscribe button. Also, turn on your post notification bell so you never miss a video. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.